It is another windy start to our day. Uh, this morning, the FAA has put a ground delay at DIA because of high winds gusts up to 40 miles an hour there. Departures are delayed almost two hours. As we're checking flight aware just this morning, there are already 500 delays and 33 cancellations. So make sure to double check with your airline before you head out to the airport. But Lisa, uh, the wind has been more than annoying. It's dangerous out there at times. Yeah, it is. Yeah, damaging winds yesterday in some cases. And today we're still going to see those wind speeds. Yeah, right around 40 to even near 60 miles per hour with our temps in the upper 50s near 60 degrees. So it is going to be on the cool side again for us today. Uh, yesterday we had gusts over 80, near 90 miles per hour. Today up and through the mountains, you're not only going to find the wind, but also some areas of blowing snow. It's continuing right at and north of of I-70 here early on this morning, where in addition to what we saw Sunday night into Monday, we could get another four to about eight inches here today. For us in town, it's going to be showers Thursday. Primarily, that would be our best chance for some wet weather across the plains. And then as we head into the weekend, things will start to warm up and dry out. But you can see some of that snow coming down heavier now west of the divide right now. Uh, in town and across the plains, it's the wind and some dry conditions. Right now, we're in the 40s and 50s. Sunny and breezy here in town, but windier on the west side of town. And we'll take a closer look at uh, how things are going to stay that way here through the end of the week. Today, Jace, right around 60 degrees between 1 and 4 o'clock, but it definitely feels cooler as those winds are howling.